know about Darwin's theory, but did you know he wasn't the first to try explaining how life changes on Earth? Back in 1789, the French scientist Georges Cuvier proposed his own theory, catastrophism. Cuvier believed that changes occur due to rare but powerful disasters, such as volcanic eruptions, meteor impacts, floods that wiped out entire species. After each disaster, species went extinct, and new ones took their place. But unlike Darwin, Cuvier didn't believe in gradual evolution. He thought new species appeared independently or were created separately. For example, Pete the Rat, who lives in a forest biome. Suddenly, a meteor hits his home. Pete dies. Later, a new species of rat appears. Cheat. But not all scientists agreed with catastrophism. In contrast, British naturalists James Hutton and Charles Lyell in the late 18th and early 19th centuries proposed uniformitarianism. They believed that the processes we see today, sedimentation, erosion, plate movement, also happened in the past, at the same rate. Even so, these theories contradicted each other, modern scientists believe that the Earth changed due to both disasters and slow processes. Cuvier started the study of Earth's history. And Pete? He is just trying to survive. <laughs>